The reason for the travel is to explore the planet, uncover diverse cultures of other people, but most important, discover ourselves. This is Around the Globe. We wanted to start our travel with a small vacation, so we decided to fly all the way from Finland to a small country or actually or a small island between Italy and Africa. Welcome to Malta. City that we came hungry, so we decided to stop for a meal. Me myself, I'm having some sort of lasagna with a rice. I've never had this one before. And I'm having on the side um, calamari squids. So I got some protein and some carbohydrates. One of the main reasons why we decided to come to Malta is to meet my good friend Jukka Nusva, who's actually a very famous Finnish streamer on Twitch TV. So after this meal, we're gonna hook up with Yuka and we're probably gonna work out a little bit in the gym and after that we're going to his apartment to do some live streaming in Finnish language. People ask us all the time how this COVID affects our trip. Well, first of all, in here in Malta, if you travel taxi or if you go anywhere inside, you have to wear face masks. When we enter to our hotel, the receptionist actually measured our temperature from our foreheads. And if the temperature was too high, they wouldn't let you into the hotel. So it doesn't matter whether you have the COVID-19 or it's just a regular fever, they won't let you in because you're at risk, basically. So people in here are extremely careful, which is obviously good, you know, you don't want to, you know, risk other people's health. So wherever we go, we always try to be as respectful as possible for the laws of the country or whenever it comes to COVID-19. workout and after the workout my friend Yuka took us to have a great dinner and apparently it's a happy hour so <laughs> we're having some drinks before the live stream so we're gonna have some steaks and burgers and have a couple of drinks and then we're gonna heading to a live stream so this is called insanity burger it has 400 grams of beef eggs and bacon <laughs> and cheddar cheese and cheddar so, <laughs> and it's it's insane it's insane <laughs> How do you like the first burger in Malta? Probably it was the best one I've ever had. Is, it, mean, is yeah. it so? Is it so? I have to be honest, it was probably yeah. because it's not a fancy fancy burger with like some some, some I don't know rosemary and whatever, but it's like fucking big, huge burger, and that's why it's called insanity burger. And the meat was actually very high quality. You could actually taste it that it was just like yeah. a burger from McDonald's. It was yeah, it was meat. Angus beef yeah. Yeah. and. I think this. I think most of the places here in Malta have really good burgers, and you can just choose whichever 
the restaurant you want to eat and this is one of the best black sheep here. And the price wasn't actually too high. It no, so it's like, not. It's 18 euros. 18 euros. So, so it's, I think it's decent. You can get a burger with 10 euros, but it's definitely not that big. Yeah, yeah. So if you're in, in real hung, hunger, that's the one you choose. Yeah. And I still got the price. <laughs> the and mojito. Sauce, so yeah. It's a good price for a good burger. Mitä vittua kolmas taso? Ajatus olisi lähteä kiertää maapallo. Tästä tulee YouTube-sarja nimeltä Around the Globe, joka toteutuu englannin kielellä. Ja käydä reissun aikana jokaisessa mielenkiintoisessa paikassa, erittäin urbaaneissa, ekstriimeissä paikoissa myös. Mutta ensimmäiseksi tultiin Maltalle moikka Jukkaa. Sitten me lähdetään viideksi viikkoa. Marbellaan treenaamaan Dorian Yatesin kanssa ja sitten sen jälkeen me lähdetään tota... Kerronkaan meistä maata jo. Me lähdetään... <tos> sitten on yksi paikka, johon me lähdetään tota... No niin, kikattakaa nyt. Mä yritin olla vakavana tässä. No niin, nyt lähtee! Nyt lähtee! Perkele! Perkele nyt vittu! Mä en kato mitään Ei mä edes kippistänyt kenenkaan, kenenkaan mä kippistän. Kyllä oi just noin. Timo, anna mennä vaan just noin. Kerrasta ei lähetä vaan. Oh my god. Kyllä mä saan Timonkin seinälle. Hei, come on. No? No lähdäänkö? Villasukat pois. Just do it. Mä pidän streamiin pystyssä, mä lupaan. I promise. If you're looking for having a nice vacation and easy traveling, Malta is the place to come. In Malta, the weather is always amazing. Over 300 sunny days a year. The food culture is, is very rich. You can actually find any types of food in Malta. The people are overall nice. No one is trying to forcefully sell you anything in the streets. The nightlife is pretty crazy. There's a lot of casinos, clubs, and even strip bars. So there's something for everyone. We have the Maltese ricotta ravioli, that's pasta refilled with ricotta cheese. If you are a meaty person, we have the ribeye 350 grams, or you, we have the tagliata, one kilo. Okay. Sounds good. good. Very good. This, this is very easy to digest. Yes. Yes. This rabbit stew is actually pretty good. I've never had rabbit before in my life. It kind of tastes like very tender lamb. So I, I like this one. I can't help myself to realize that you can actually see the long, long history of Malta in the architecture world. <laughs> As a matter of fact, Malta was first inhabited in 5900 before Christ. During the Ice Age, the island of Malta was actually connected to the Italian mainland, so perhaps the history of Malta might be even older than the history of sailing. <laughs> because this trip is all about joy, and because of COVID-19, we have realized that people in Malta are a little bit down and depressed. So we want to spread joy and laughter to the people, so I'm going to start a water fight with random people. Let's do this.
Malta is very unique by its size. Everything is very small and everything is very close, including these supermarkets are extremely small, but they're filled with products. Um, as you can see, it's kind of hard for me to walk around here because it's kind of... Kind of actually, I, I can't fit from here. I have to go back. So today is the last day in Malta. We decided to come to a sky beach, which is a pool area on the top of the hotel. As you can see in the background, the view is incredible. Soon we are heading back to the airport and we will go to our next destination. So if you do not want to miss the next episode, please be sure to subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.